So I feel bad I haven't put anything up for a while. I've been working on software mostly, um, particularly to control this uh, new guitar, the Buzz Saw. Uh, and the Buzz has a composer mode where you can take inputs from a synth, which has somewhat distracted me because I've fallen into the black hole of, of uh, air guitar uh, playing MIDI that I pick up off the, the web. Uh, all for the purpose of getting the tuning better, of course, but I thought I'd show that off uh, today. So first, a quick tour of the Buzz. I got uh, a couple surface mount motors here, DC motors, 12 volt motors. Um, this is uh, mechanisms all described on the website. I got them on uh, wire ties so I can swap them in and out. Uh, there's the slide pots. You can see there that provide the tuning. Uh, a couple springs. Uh, this is the bridge. It's, because it's an active bridge because the string slides. It's a couple of uh, fairly massive bearings, uh, skateboard bearings. A dual pickups so I can process the string separately. I'm not doing that right now. They're just added together. These are tiny pickups made out of relay coils and there's little rare earth magnets stuck on the side and those are the uh, feedback for the auto tuning which runs all the time it's being played. I got a string clamp uh, which cuts the retuning. Uh, it takes a little force off of the uh, tuning machines. And there's the hand whammy uh, which goes to a, uh, a whammy box. It just uh, lets you do something with your hands while the notes are being sequenced. Uh, and it's a lot of fun. Here's the uh, electronics off board. A couple of uh, audio amplifiers which are used for the servo amp. Uh, and I have two Arduinos. Uh, you want to use as many Arduinos as possible. In this case, one of them is uh, doing the tuning uh, and the auto-tuning, so it's doing the auto-correlations while the thing's running. This is on the, the website. And the other one's just doing the MIDI decoding, and there's a little uh, auxiliary circuit board with some burn marks. Uh, and there's the MIDI cable, and this goes to a dongle that is a USB uh, MIDI uh, converter cable. And I'm running synthesizer, sequencer. This is Cakewalk and I've got uh, a song from the Three Dog Night. Uh, Mama told me not to come. Uh, I gotta use both hands to play that so I'm gonna set this up so you can see the uh, the guilty pleasure of playing other people's music uh, as the servo motors move. Okay so you can see how I set this up uh, for Cakewalk right now. I, I've uh, selected not Microsoft's GS Wavetable wave Synth, but a uh, USB device. This is the USB to uh, MIDI uh, cable. I got one on Amazon for about five bucks. Uh, and uh, the two strings, one is decoded to channel one, uh, and the other one is decoded to uh, channel two. I don't see that here. Put the bass line on channel two. Oh, there it is. Okay, so. Servo 2 is, is the melody, uh, and Servo 1 is, uh, I just put the bass, pulled this off of uh, MIDI site, and uh, so I'll go ahead and pull up the uh, score, okay, and we'll reset this, and I'll set the camera out so you can see uh, the servo motors as well.